Hey everybody, Jeff Hunter here, Pro Chevrolet, Sioux St. Marie, Ontario. Today I'm sitting in a beautiful 2018 GMC train, and the reasoning why I'm sitting in this vehicle today is to show you something pretty cool, pretty unique that GMC is offering in the train that they aren't in any other vehicle, which has probably already caught your eye, and that is this right down here. This is what GMC calls the EPS or electronic precision shift. Now you might be asking yourself, well, why did they do that? What why did they go that way to an electronic shifter? Well, Right off the bat, I can tell you, um, it's to eliminate some things. So what we can now eliminate is the, the the shifter and the linkage and all the moving parts that come with a normal gear shifter. We are not going to have a gear shifter here, so it frees up space. We're not going to have a gear shifter here. And also, with another cables running below, we also free up space here. So we have storage on either side down here, which we didn't normally have. Not only that, but something that some people don't think about is with, you know, again, with the shifter and the linkage and moving parts, those cables are running through here. In behind here, and although you don't see it when you're sitting in the vehicle, there's more open spots in behind which creates more noise more noise in the cabin well they're able to eliminate that with this electronic precision shift because now they can close up more areas that were open which of course creates a, a, a quieter cabin which is something we're always looking for um now, as far as the system itself, I can tell you firsthand that this is a slick and easy system to use. I know right off the bat it might be disconcerting and it's a little different looking, which of course I know it is, but I can tell you again firsthand that it is really easy to use. I mean, one or two times it might, you know, might take you a time or two to get used to it, but once you've used it, uh, it, it is really slick and easy to use. You can, and you can simply uh, keep your fingers here and go uh, right from reverse to park, uh, drive very, very uh, quickly, very easily. You have your manual shift over here. Now, I know one of the concerns, and I've had a few concerns and questions people had. Okay, well, what if what happens if I'm in drive and you know I'm driving along and somebody hits the reverse? If you're going 10 kilometers an hour or more, it'll not allow the vehicle to go from drive back to reverse. It's a safeguard. Um, also, the other question I had: Well, what if what if I'm in reverse or drive and all of a sudden somebody hits the park button or I accidentally you know hit the park button? If you're going, uh, I think it's five it's five kilometers an hour or more, it'll not allow the vehicle to to do that either. Some more safeguards. What if I, uh, you know, what if I get out of the vehicle and, uh, you know, I open the I open the driver's door and I, I've forgotten to put it in park. As soon as you open this driver's door, it'll automatically put that vehicle in park. Not to mention, if I were to turn the vehicle off and I was in drive, it'll actually uh, put it in park as well. In fact, you can actually hear that. So let's let's give you an example. I'm gonna step on the brake. I'm gonna put the vehicle in drive. You heard the doors lock as it always does. Now, if I were to just to press this button off, you're gonna hear the doors unlock. Just listen because it's put it in park right off the bat because it's reading that I did not do it myself. So here we go, let's put it, let's uh, turn the vehicle off. There you go, it automatically put it in park. So again, GM has thought of, uh, you know, a bunch of different things in terms of the safety, uh, the safeguards on it. Um, and you know, it's a really, again, it's a really slick, really simple, really easy system to use, but you definitely have to try it for yourself. So come see me, Pro Chevrolet. Take this for a spin because again, uh, you know, it's something that you have to try for yourself.